So the next thing that I want to do is make this slider only show on the home page. Inside of header.php, we're going to add inside of theme structure, header.php, conditional slider. And we'll take this so now what <clears throat> what the plan is here is that we're going to create a home page template and we're going to create a static home page um, inside of WordPress and we're going to update the WordPress reading settings to use a new page that we create called home as the home page and use that set template and we're going to include this slider on that page when that page is detected so the first thing that we're going to do is create a file called slider.php and we're going to store it inside of the an INC folder and I'm just going to paste our short code here So I'm going to create a new folder, INC. I'm going to call it slider. Okay. So now if I refresh on the home page, the slider will be gone. So what we're going to do now is create a new template. And we're going to name it home, excuse me, home dash template dot php. And here under your home-template.php folder, number one, the create home page template. So this is going to define that home page template. And what I'm going to do here. <clears throat> Is select all of this, this entire section here. I'm going to take this out of the index.php file. And I'm going to put this inside of the home template. So now inside of our home template, we have the same code that we had to build that featured post area that was inside of the index page. We're actually going to use the index page for handling archives and categories and things like that. So now that we have this template created, let's go under pages. Add new. I'll name this home. And for the template, I'll select the home page template. And just so that you can see, um, here nothing is going to be showing but the header and the footer. And that's because if there's, you know, if, until we set this page, as the front page of the site, it's going to use the index.php as the template. And currently, there's nothing in there. 
except for the header and the footer. So now we're going to come under settings, reading. And we're going to set a static page. And for the front page, we're going to select home. And we're going to save changes. So now when we refresh, and we need to update our header to use the home slug and change this slug to whatever page um, slug that you're, you're using. And you can find your slug right here. So this one is just home. So now that that's saved to the server, let's refresh. And we'll see our slider here. Let's come under sample page. And we do not have a slider. And in terms of responsiveness, if we drag in, you see the categories. Sidebar is on top. Our content area below. Menu. 